nestled, nestled between the hills of <laughs> Norf Norford and Bactar? Norford and Bactar. Nestled between the hills of Norford and Bactar Forest. Okay, no. <laughs> <laughs> Huh, um, okay. Nestled between the hills of Norford and the Bactar Forest, there is a small farming village. The people that live here affectionately call this place the Barrow. Some whisper that the name refers to the tomb of an ancient king that is hidden somewhere in the Norford Hills, full of treasure waiting to be discovered. To the outside world, the barrow means nothing, but to you, it simply means home. It's cute. Yeah, so, as good a place to start as any. Yeah. Okay. Are you ready? Yeah. Are you excited? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Um, do I have to have my character voice ready? No. Okay. No. Because I don't... Most people discover it. window. A new dawn breaks upon the barrow. You awaken and rise from your bed. What do you do? Uh, you can do anything. So, um, you know, uh, go downstairs, get some breakfast, explore the town. What do you want to do first? I don't know. Okay, it's okay. It's okay, Cameron. I, I just don't know what to do. Oh, it's sorry. Okay. It's okay. Really, it's Cameron. It's just a game. <laughs> it's just a game. Sorry. You don't have to be sorry. There's nothing to be sorry about. It's okay. Cameron, we can just pick up the pieces. We don't have to play this. It's not important. You found a tomb in your hometown. Uh, you have made your way through the opening door into a circular stone room. It is dank, dark, but standing before you is a goblin, armed to the teeth and ready to fight you for whatever gold lies below. What do you do? I attack it. Okay. Roll a d20. Okay. That's not the best roll. Oh. You charge forward, <laughs> attacking the goblin with your... Can I use my dagger? Absolutely. I use my, I try and stab, stab it with the dagger. 
Seeing that the goblin's defenses are down, you draw your dagger and try to stab underneath his arms, but the goblin sees...